gentle tips. How are you guys doing today? I have a, uh, a really dense tree over here where it's got like really, really thin um, branches and heavy vegetation and uh, all the good stuff to test out the obstacle avoidance on the Scadio. So we're going to go ahead and do a little walk through that area and see how exactly the Scadio does avoiding really dense branches and vegetation and uh, really really see how much it surprises us how it fares in that kind of a environment unfortunately by this area thankfully not close enough but in this area so i'm gonna have to take it real easy uh the good old bee farms are back the good old bee boxes if you guys were around during my uh bxd versus wild video you'll know exactly what i'm talking about if you haven't seen the bxd versus wild go ahead and cue that up for the next video online and uh you can watch me walk into a, a damn near millions of bees with nothing but uh, some shorts or uh, some pants, a hoodie, and my motorcycle helmet. And uh, that was some good times. All right, I'm trying to do this without getting rear-ended and fucking flying off my bike 100 feet. All right, so we're gonna go in here. Usually where people have the big old garbage dump, but surprisingly, and kudos to whoever the hell's been doing it, someone's been coming here and like cleaning up and shit. So I, I think that's really cool and respectable. But uh, we might be able to launch the drone right here and this will be fun. But yeah, there's the boxes right down there in the distance. Now for all I know, there could be some homeless people here. Cause you guys remember, this was like that homeless encampment, that abandoned homeless encampment. So, Oh, fuck watch my luck dude my luck someone's gonna be there and i'm just gonna be fucking riding there the drone like what's up dude <laughs> but uh who is a big old hawk in the sky right there i'm only scared one of those is gonna swoop up on the sky deal and try to fucking take it out but um yeah we're gonna be venturing in here and through there there's a there's a really dense tree overhanging area and we're gonna take a few little walks and laps around that and then we're going to see how the skydio 2 does doing some uh some pretty intense obstacle avoidance avoidance in this area so let me go and put her in the sky and i'll see you guys in a second so we're gonna open the app make sure our wi-fi is connect oh connect phone yep i got a wi-fi to connect my phone beacon 48 boom connected open the app let it start its engine and we're good to go so I'm going to stick it as low as I can to the ground. Like I said, look at all that shrubbery. You guys, I'm sure not one of you in this in the chat watching this video would goddamn dare trust a DJI Mavic or any of, any other drone to go do this exact thing. So let's see. I'm putting, hey, I'm putting my drone on the line, guys. I'm putting my drone on the line right now. I don't want this thing fucked up. I don't want it to crash. This is my, this is my, this is my most prized possession right now. I love this thing. Take off. There we go. Alright, so for this, I want this as low as it can to the ground. All the way. There we go. Let's do it. Let's do it. Alrighty. What are we going to find in here? What are we going to find? What are we going to find? Oh! That worked. You know what? I never went down this way. Oh man, this is creepy. What's up with shoes? That's like a cowboy boot. Oh, here it is. Alright guys, if I see somebody, I'm bolting. This place always gives me the fucking creeps. Somebody here? Video. Look at it. Look at it. Going through the tree. <laughs> oh man, that's just cool as hell. 
Are you serious? You're actually going through the trees? What if I go like this? Right by this shooting range, that's creepy as fuck. What's over here, damn it? This is creepy. Dude, this is really scary. It's like a backstop. This could be like a shooting thing. I can only imagine how sticky and gross this is. Dude, that drone's tripping me out how good it's avoiding everything. <laughs> Look, it just goes with me. Look at this. Which one of you guys would confidently let, a, let your drone do this right now? What are you doing? So he's even telling me right now that like that it's like, alright, you're in a really dense spot, man. Look, it's in the middle of the trees. But look, it knows. It lets you know, too. So if you weren't paying attention to the drone, and you're like, hey, guy, you just put me in a literal clusterfuck of trees. And the drone's like, but you know what? I got you. So every time I come here, I never see a person, but this thing's always transformed. It looks like it caved in. <laughs> Can you imagine some dude sleeping here? And then he's, a, he's like a knocked out, dead asleep, and this thing just collapsed and he just falls onto the ground. Make sure I'm not stepping on an H needle. You gonna follow me through this or what? I dare you. I dare you. Oh my God, it's actually doing. No, you can't get away from it. You can't get away from it. Oh my God. Are you serious? <laughs> Dude, I'm flabbergasted. All right, you want to come back under here with me? Come on, you got enough room. You got enough room. Come on. You got it. Come on. That ain't nothing for you. That ain't no thing but a chicken wing. Now what if I want to put you in there? What are you going to do about that? What are you going to do about that? See if it follows me back through. So, uh, I don't know what else more to say if it just went through that. I mean, <laughs> that is fucking crazy, dude. This is just crazy as hell. I can't, I can't fathom how cool this is. All right, let's hit the trail all the way to the end. I'll let the drone figure out where it wants to go. You can follow. You gonna figure it out? See? You got a mind of your own. You don't need no you don't need no man in your life to tell you what to do. You could figure it out. You don't need no stinking man in your life. None. Not one. Yeah, on a real note though, when I pass these bees, I'm gonna have to like actually let me front ride it so it's not going over them. Actually, let me full ride it. See, I'm at the bees right now. I gotta go quick. Go, 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 go. Shit, shit. I don't want the bees to fucking. I don't wanna chop any bees up, man. I learned my lesson, man. One time I borrowed Captain Man's Mavic and I went up in a field and, uh, Long story short, I got home that day and I ended about 200 bees families 
in uh, one flight. I felt really terrible about that. I kind of like the side-scrolling perspective, don't you? Like, it gives you a nice little perspective of what it, where I'm at. I'll give you a little back perspective. It's gotten real uh, dicey through this trail lately. Real dicey. Oh, ow! That had to have been a bent rim right there. No doubt. Ow. Check my rim. All right, I think my rim's fine. Oh man, that hurt. That hurt really bad. That hurt my, my feelings and my soul and my hands. Beacon off. Zipper on up. Got my stuff, my steez. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that, my friends, is the magical obstacle avoidance that uh, is damn near like some alien like technology. I'm not gonna lie, the way it navigated those trees was something of magic, man. That was. I, that that actually impressed me even I wasn't even expecting it to do all that like instead of going over the trees the safest route it's like here hold my beer and it just goes right under the damn tree in the bushes and in between the, the trees and my god that was awesome but I hope I got to answer some of the questions the burning desiring questions you guys had uh, if you guys have got any more questions or tests you want me to do feel free to let me know um, I'm really active in my comments, and as always, thank you guys for watching. All links will be down below if you want to support me in any way, shape, or form. If you want to get on my keychains, stickers, shirts, sweaters, all the goodness, or support me on Patreon. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the fuck out of that like button. You guys have a, a real good day. I'll see you guys later. Twelve.